Hello and welcome to today's video on ants adaption in an environment. Let's start the video. Ants are highly adaptable creatures that have successfully colonized almost every terrestrial habitat on Earth. Their ability to thrive in diverse environments can be attributed to a range of remarkable adaptations. Let's explore some of these adaptations in detail in this video. So, if you are new to this channel, then subscribe to my channel for upcoming videos. Social organization. Ants exhibit complex social organization within their colonies. Each colony typically consists of a queen, female workers, and sometimes male drones. The division of labor allows for efficient resource allocation and specialization. Workers perform tasks such as foraging, nest maintenance, and caring for the brood. While the queen's primary role is reproduction. Communication. Ants communicate through a variety of chemical and tactile signals. They release pheromones, which are chemical substances used for marking trails, recognizing nestmates, and signaling danger. Ants also use antennation, touching antennae, to exchange information and recognize individuals. Nest construction. Ants build intricate nests that provide protection, temperature regulation, and a suitable environment for the colony. Different ant species exhibit diverse nest building strategies, including excavating soil, constructing mounds, or utilizing pre existing crevices. Some ants even build complex multi chambered structures with specific areas for brood rearing food storage, and waste disposal. Foraging adaptations. Ants have evolved various foraging strategies depending on their ecological niche. Some species scavenge for food, while others engage in hunting or farming. Certain ants have specialized body structures, such as strong mandibles for cutting leaves or powerful stingers for subduing prey. They can also exploit different food sources, ranging from dead insects and nectar to seeds and fungi. Eusociality. Ants are eusocial insects, which means they exhibit a high level of social organization and cooperation. This eusociality allows for the division of labor, cooperative brood care, and the formation of elaborate caste systems. The reproductive queen produces offspring, while the non-reproductive workers assist in colony maintenance and defense. Ability to carry and transport. Ants have developed specialized adaptations for carrying and transporting objects. They possess strong mandibles and a robust exoskeleton that enables them to lift and carry items many times their own body weight. This ability is crucial for tasks such as moving food, building nests, and relocating the colony if necessary. Thermal regulation. Ants have mechanisms to regulate their body temperature and survive in diverse climates. Some species construct nests that maintain a stable temperature, shielding them from extreme heat or cold. Ants can also exhibit behavioral adaptations, such as changing their activity patterns or seeking shelter during unfavorable conditions. Defense mechanisms Ants have evolved various defense mechanisms to protect themselves and their colonies. These include biting, stinging, or spraying chemical irritants. Some ants also display aggressive behavior, like swarming and releasing alarm pheromones, to deter potential threats. Colony reproduction. Ant colonies can reproduce and expand their populations through different mechanisms. The queen produces eggs, which develop into larvae and pupae. The emerging adults become workers, contributing to the colony's growth and functioning. In certain species, colonies can also produce winged males and females during specific times of the year for mating and establishing new colonies. Overall, ants' adaptability in different environments can be attributed to their social organization. Communication methods, nest construction abilities, diverse foraging strategies, eusociality, strength, and carrying capacity, thermal regulation mechanisms, defense mechanisms, and reproductive capabilities.
These adaptations have allowed ants to thrive and dominate various ecosystems worldwide. I hope so now you will understand about ants adaption in an environment. Thanks for watching my content. If you like my content press the like button. And subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. Thank you goodbye.